Hello and welcome to Mooncroft Iron Debats and uh, here's something very quickly just for the for the nerds. <laughs> um, Dai has been uh, very generous again uh, to me. I asked him for this uh, some time ago and I, I always had this uh, plan as well um, but uh, I don't think I ever voiced it but uh, I think we're gonna do it um, and bear in mind this is the the last bridge right Lord of the Rings mm -hmm. so let's just take that out see ya and he got me uh, emerald ore because he lives in extreme hills or on the border of it uh, I asked him if he could silk touch one if he came across it boom and so that is uh if you don't know, <laughs> that is the uh, meant to be the, the beryl stone, the pale green beryl stone that has left a left as a sign um, that uh, uh, the way the way onwards was safe. At least that's how it was interpreted. Um, all right, <laughs> I just wanted to get that done because it's been sat in my uh, ender chest for a while now. So cool. <laughs> and it says it's um, in the book. It says it's left in the middle, middle of the bridge, in the mud. Uh, there's no mud, but um, it's kind of in the middle of the bridge. I mean, you know, why would you put it in the middle, by the way? <laughs> you stick it on one end, because if you're not sure if the bridge is gonna is uh, safe to cross or not, you're not gonna, um, you know, head over halfway. <laughs> anyway, that's by the by. We've got some mine shafting to do, so Al, let me head there, and I'll catch you in a sec. Okay, so the moment is here that I've been putting off. <laughs> I do. I do still find uh, Minecraft quite a quite a nervy game, and um, incidentally, did you know, <laughs> Minecraft is the biggest selling PC game ever. It's overtaken uh, World of Warcraft in terms of numbers of copies sold, if not actual subscriptions. You know, so yeah, 16 million sales. Um, so wow, <laughs> that's a lot of money. I mean, what are they? What is it? Ten pounds? Ten pounds ago? 160 million pounds. Huh. Anyway, um, I've made this little entrance, and the, um, and there was some wood here which I've uh, from the mine shaft which, which I've cleared away, but uh, it carries on up there. So I'm gonna head up on. Green is not good to see at the corner of the right, which I'm gonna um, go up and get. And um, I'm not gonna record the whole thing. Well, I mean, I will record it, but I'm not gonna show the whole thing. Uh, so uh, if anything exciting happens, I'll be sure to get back with you. Uh, unless I can think of something interesting to talk about. Um, I haven't really found anything of uh, too much interest. Uh, no name tags, no nothing like that. But um, I just sort of came came from where did I, oh God <laughs> came from up here, I think, and then just kind of headed down here just to, just to have a look and see. I've put some torches down just to see, but it's like go uh, mm. oh, loud. So there's more down there. There's more along there, and there's some torches down there which I may have put somehow getting in that direction. A big ravine with lots of chances of things dropping. So uh, yeah, tense. Ooh, <laughs> very tense. I'm curious though as to what. Obviously, I've been down there, so. Hmm. But um, I've only found one one minecart which had uh, just some lapis and some bread. I think. Oh, hello. Get lost. Ooh. Very tense. Right there. And uh, I have bought my um, silk touch shears, so I've been collecting some cobwebs. Some of the stuff I've already put back in the base, but um, no spider spawners as yet. Um, we're going to keep on going that. Uh, cobblestone over there now is that I keep running into parts of my base and I keep being able to hear the um, nether spawner so at least I know there's a relatively quick escape route but that's got to be 
Aha, and look, we're down here. Oh yes, this is the cow route. Perfect. All right, well at least I know a quick way of getting here because I'm probably never going to be able to find or be certain that I'm back here again. All right, I shall carry on. That's very dark. Hmm. Come on. There we go. And as I said before, part of this is just really just to um, prevent the nightly noises. <laughs> so, uh, hopefully that's going all right. Difficult to tell. Especially as this is on so many levels as well. I mean, I'm only on, uh, yeah, 46. So I'm not exactly deep. Ooh, poor bat. <laughs> anyway, let me carry on and um, uh, <laughs> be frightened on my own. All right, see you shortly, I hope. Alrighty, well, my nerves can't take it any any longer. <laughs> I've done. Uh, um, oop, hello. Uh, I've done as much as I, th I think I reasonably can. Um, no real uh, finds of any any note. Um, not that many minecarts really. And they just tend to have bread, <laughs> bread in them, and uh, I think one piece of iron horse armor I found. But um, there's still more of the mineshaft to go, but I can't find it. <laughs> um, I'll, I'll need to come down through the um, through the ravine. I think once it's uh, daylight. Uh, yeah. So um, meanwhile, you know, I've got a, a ton of iron, which I've now put into blocks, a little bit more of some gold, just in my most, most recent run, most recent run, oh. um, so yeah, I think what I might do is do maybe some more branch mining, and um, I do want to tidy that area up a bit, and uh, a bit annoyed actually, because B00 <laughs> on his Minecraft is doing exactly that, and I, you know, I wanted to do that. <laughs> before he started so but I might do it anyway but I just won't necessarily show it in any sort of great detail um, just in case of accusations of copying which of course I'd never do um, so yeah so that's it really um, Mr. Tomp is on he's gonna start working on the moon world sign I believe um, so yeah, so that should be good. So we'll have a look at that, maybe next episode. Um, but we we should be doing something this evening, um, which is why I'm on right now. Um, uh, some fun and games. Um, not quite sure what yet. It's just going to be <laughs> people turning up, and then we'll decide what to do. It might be might be the Minecraft Realms mini games, which we tried about we tried about a week ago, and that was a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure he'll be fine. <laughs> he gets a ton of them. <laughs> um, so, so yeah, so that's that. And um, other things to do. Um, w one of the things I was considering is obviously this house is, um, you know, there's uh, certain dimensions here which I want to take, which uh, w which are taken all the way down to the bottom. Um, but then I want to do sort of like a radius out, so I really need to mark out the area a bit more, and um, also just kind of test how how less noisy it is now. Um, but certainly um, I want to expand out a bit, not not this area so much, although I am starting to run out of chests. <laughs> but certainly some of the farm areas need um, need sorting out <laughs> fairly urgently, um, and they're pretty pretty horribly done, you know. The way that the things just kind of stop on the edge. I might want to put like a border and then, excuse me, and then expand it out a bit. Oh gosh. Um. Yeah. So that's pretty much it. I've just been doing some farming. Um. So things like this, particularly, you know, the cactus. I mean, that's terrible, right? I mean, you know, it's of use, but it it could be better. Um. And then certainly expand out the the animals. Uh, certainly the cows need a bit more room. Um, now, are you working or are you full with eggs? Yeah, you're full with eggs. I don't know why it does that. When I'm not around, it fills up and then it doesn't dispense. 
Let's see. It does it one at a time. You're going to die if you stay there. But anyway, so every now and then I have to go in and, and clear these out. So huh. anyway, that's it for now. Um, thanks for watching uh, and uh, be nice to each other. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Tati bye.